What's up, y'all, man? Fat Cat back with another video. This time, I'm doing a bad tutorial video, and we're working on Offensive Crasher. Now, to get Offensive Crasher, I believe you need 150 offensive rebounds. Yeah, I think you need 150 offensive rebounds. Um, so this is, I'm basically in this video, I'm going to show y'all how I get my offensive rebounds. As you see, I'm grabbing one right there. Now, what I do is, on offense, I go down low. And I cap around in the paint. I run in and out of bounds just so I won't get three seconds in the paint. Yeah. Some, a lot of times, too, I hold circle down there to, like, hold my nuts, basically. I'm holding circle so I don't get any contact animations while I'm down low trying to get the offensive rebounds. Now, be careful with that holding circle stuff because you will get a personal foul down low. So just be careful with that. But basically, all I do is... I bob in and out of um, the paint so I don't get three seconds. And basically, pay attention to the shot clock. You have to pay attention to the shot clock because once once the shot clock is low enough, your teammates will shoot, so you need to be ready. You need to be ready to grab the offensive rebound. I do have my settings on Hall of Fame, difficulty, and simulation game style. Therefore, it's harder to make shots, and they're most likely going to miss more shots as you see them snagging another offensive board. Also, another tip is to pay attention to your players. The closer your players are to the rim, the more likely they're going to shoot the ball, so you have to be ready. As you see, Zach Levine is very close to the rim, so he's obviously going to shoot. I grab the offensive rebound. Zach Levine, again, close to the rim. I grab the offensive rebound. So basically, you just really have to pay attention to your players and basically pay attention to the shot clock another one Carl Anthony Towns extremely close to the rim he shoots I grab the offensive rebound also try to grab your own boards too that always helps you see I missed one and I grabbed it again now this one look the shot clock pay attention to that shot clock two seconds one he throws up some bull I grab the board try to put it back up but obviously I get fouled this is another pay attention to the shot clock. You see, once it hits about five seconds on the shot clock, that's when I start to go in and try to, I stay in the paint and try to just fight for position the whole time. I don't even think about three seconds once I, it's like five seconds left on the shot clock because you're most likely not going to get called for it. Another one, shot clock. I don't care about three seconds. I'm just down low trying to get the board. So basically that's it. Remember these tips. I hope this helps you get offensive crasher. It certainly helped me. I have multiple centers, and I have offensive crasher on all of them. So I hope this helps you. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And really, that's it. Thank you all for watching, man. I'm going to show a screenshot at the end of how many offensive rebounds I got in one of these games. I can't remember which one. But we out.